marriage i said to you wiki is a factor and tinubu is a factor some of you don't understand what i mean i mean wiki is a factor the reason is because if you are pushing governor his excellency governor wiki aside and you don't factor him in you will see that he's a factor and i say if you want to push the new boy away i said this thing one check the prophet okay guys quickly if you look my screen very well this update they come from bro joshua ijela also if you look again i go see four top nigeria politicians three now uh three major uh presidential candidate comes 2023 one for insian and river state governor governor yesim wiki my people before i go allow now watch this full video when i don't say bro joshua ijela another prophet for inside nigeria be pastor when they always they like give top prophecy concerning nigeria politicians most especially when it comes to this 2023 presidential election bro joshua ijela if you read the follow and up him don't give many many prophecies when like say man he full inside social media you understand even the time when they fight for delegates who go win the vote who go win the ticket this man give many many prophecy you understand and right now in constant let us know say nigeria as a country and all these our um three major presidential candidates say make we continue to pray for them they need our prayers and our country nigeria need peace and unity my question now be say since since i was born me urom picking i don't the year say make we pray for nigeria make we pray for nigeria and things are getting worse worse as in like from home as in everything don't become zero for nigeria make could not get me wrong i don't say prayers not the work prayers they work 100 percent activate i don't come understand all this our daddy juice again you understand for now for me for any pastor to stand for altar they say pray pray let's pray let's pray just tell your member say go out there go get your pvc ready you understand because let them know say election day make una vote you understand forget all this issue of let's pray let's pray let's pray pray for how long now the more we they pray the more everything they worst you understand well guys right now make it not be like say i to talk or i to waste my time make i live on a jj jj make i watch this full video while i go see you now for the ending of this video like i told you that there's nothing new that is coming but there are enemies Who are sworn enemies of this country? Who are so selfish? Who rather want to plumb and put this country in total darkness for their singular selfish ambition? This prayer point, I will give you in form of prayer point. We are going to pray for all the contestants. I'm going to pray that there should be no attempt to squatter the life of any of these major contestants. So that we can so that we don't get to a place where we are arguing rather than moving forward. We don't want bitterness. We don't want Nigerian to be put in darkness. You see, this prayer point, I'm putting it as a prayer point. Let me use it. The Lord all the major contestants or all the contestants who are presidential candidates god protects them there should be no attempt of poison no attempt to use the bullet no attempt of assassination thing this election is over and after the election especially we do the election during the election and we can get the result ahead. but no attempt should be made because i want to there is a craft spirit i'm behind and i will clam on anything to go to the front please take my prayer point very important see see we can gather here because there is peace when there's no peace that's what the Bible said. We should be looking for the good of our Jerusalem. You see, anything that will bring restlessness. Hey, they're after my life. They want to do this to me. Hey, you don't touch somebody with a large follower. 
There should be no conspiracy theory. If you are sure of yourself, go to the field and let the people vote you. You don't need, we don't need the craft spirit. The Lord will keep Nigeria. Amen. Amen. See, the reason why I'm talking in parable, you see, there are some years I will just come out, I'll be bold, I will tell you. Yes, I said to you last week Sunday, I've seen it clear. But I'm cautioned by God not to talk clearly. But I passed my confidence information of what I have seen to few people around me and say, this is how it's going to be. I've seen it clearly. And let me tell you the truth. Let's remove emotions. Let's remove sentiment. Nigeria is in the hands of God. I will be talking like this. But as I'm talking, if you are a man of the spirit, you'll be able to pick what I'm saying. You, you might not like this way. You might not like that way. It doesn't stop it. The Veku, this Nigeria, is in the hands of God. Not in the hand of any man of God. Not even in my hand. Not in the hand of any human being. Not even in the power broker. I told you. I say, the mystery of what is about to happen in this 2023 election, as even the players will be confused. Go and check my prophetic track. Check what I say. And during the primaries, I said to you, Wike is a factor and Tinubu is a factor. Some of you don't understand what I mean. I mean Wike is a factor. The reason is because if you are pushing Governor, His Excellency Governor Wike aside, and you don't factor him in, you will see that he's a factor. And I say, if you want to push Tinubu away, I said this thing, go and check the prophecy. That time, everybody was saying Tinubu will never become an APC candidate. I'm not vying for anybody. And I say, he is a factor. You are here. Go and check the prophecy. And I'm still standing again to still tell you to the opposition, Wike is a factor. And Tinubu is already what? A factor. The rest, I leave it to destiny. If you like, I'm not saying anything, but I'm saying what I have said. Go and check it. It was all over the social media. What is he saying? I say what? Wike is a factor. Tinubu is a that time they have not picked any of. They have not picked. And I and when he, when Wike lost the election, I was smiling. I felt that the powers in this other place would have seen that. I said, he is a factor. Whether you abuse him from Nantin tomorrow, I say, for those of you who are mathematicians, what we say, he is a factor in an equation. You understand? So if you like, abuse me from Nantin tomorrow. And I've warned men of God, be careful. Don't prophesy what you don't understand. So that the name of the Lord might not be blasphemed among the Gentiles. And I'm going to stop here. And I will leave you. The outcome of this election, you understand what I mean by Wiki is a factor and Tinubu is a factor. So guys, I also want to watch the full video from Bro Joshua Ijela. I bet me could let me know for the comment section what you una think concerning waiting uh Bro Joshua Ijela talk for inside this video because if you really take una time to listen and watch this full video, and I go see and say this man talk many many things for inside this video, and him also talk in parable. You understand? Well, my own opinion for inside this video, as I first tell you now for the beginning of this very video, when be like so now they see for my screen. So me, bro, me picking. I not disagree. Say God not they or uh, prayers not they work. You understand? Prayers they work, but when it comes to politics for Nigeria, Nigeria as a country, we need action. This one will be time to the pray, guys. Believe me, if we like, make una pray now to next year, December. Nothing will change because this life not be everything God needs to from heaven come do for we as a human being. You understand? Because there are some things when be like, say, man, you need to do on your own, not call God name in vain. Now be Nigeria problem.
this issue of let's pray let's pray let's pray now wasting of time guys you understand election already come, comes february 2023 let's let we all go out there let's go and cast our vote for mr peter obi labor party presidential candidate you understand because if you now look out of the three major candidates for inside nigeria and be like say they contest for this 2023 election we go we get one major one we'll be like say me yes he's qualified to rule nigeria you understand he gets everything to take rule nigeria he's physically fit as in he get everything there with him you understand well guys make it not be like say i to talk or i to waste to matter once again case today now the first time when they come across this youtube channel you are highly welcome to room picking blog please kindly subscribe hit on that notification bell so that anytime we'll be like say me we take drop any new update here, you go be among the first person when go receive the notification so guys i go leave on right now i go see you now for the next update coming out soon respect one love guys nigeria is a scam hey nobody believe god though everybody not the same